I've been in the kitchen, whipping, whipping. I've been chefing, mix it with my left hand. So right now we're walking through the streets of San Juan and it's it's lush. I mean, it's so beautiful. The color of the concrete on the walls and the people, they're so friendly and so lively. I mean, you really truly feel like you're you're in a new home. And right now we're about to get picked up by our driver Danny. He's pulling up right now in the van. This neighborhood is the, is the, is the real Puerto Rico, for sure. We're really looking for the most authentic and local experience possible. Get the twist. Corona. Corona, sí. Estamos ¿Cuánto tiempo llevas por acá? Yo. Sí. 64 años. Danny decided to take us to his favorite spot to eat lunch. He hyped it up so much that he decided to join us for it. So delicious. I love it. Solomon's Barbecue. Uh, and apparently it's one of the best around. Um, uh, rotisserie chicken, arroz con candules, which is like my mom makes on the, on the reg. That's my favorite, it's like all the way through, it's not, oh my god. I think that's one of the best reds I've actually had. This is incredible. I can't believe the driver's eating with us. This is Puerto Rican rotisserie chicken. The best ever here in Puerto Rico. You see Sullivan's Barbecue, where we're eating, there's a truck right there. People are driving, people are walking, people are getting lunch. Uh, you can't ask for more. Sullivan's really did serve some of the best chicken I've ever had. Danny's driving us to the second location right now. It's a seafood place I've heard about. The locals love it. It's fresh. Let me tell you something right now. <laughs> Let me tell you something. Puerto Rican chicas. Oh. Mamacitas. Oh, it's exquisite. Like, oh, I can't eat it. Dios mío. Beautiful. <laughs> I thought I was ready for this. I thought I was prepared. I wasn't. Dude, I As we're riding through these streets, I'm starting to realize that this isn't just a food show. This is more of a show about us and our experience with the people here. I'm ready to eat though. This is a food show about us, a group of friends who decided to eat some good ass food. Puerto Rico. As soon as we walk in, it's just people, people are up and all just welcoming us. Um, it feels really. Homey. I mean, the people that are, are running this restaurant, they're, they're a family. We're getting a uh, Chio Frito, which is fried snapper, and then we're definitely gonna hop on the Camarones Empanados, so the breaded shrimp. We're right by the beach. We're in a really local area. I don't see any tourists around here. But we're getting a fried fish right now. I'm about to take you guys back into the kitchen so you can see what's going on there. Sencillo de Tauci Food, una de las comidas tradicionales de Tauci Food. Is this one of the most Where's my pina colada? I mean, you saw it. We were we cooked it up for us and put it, slapped it on a plate, and that's as good as you get. So the thing is, it's like, Yo, like people talk about fresh, you know, and it's like you go to like different like the high end seafood restaurants, and it's like they get a fresh, but dude, they they caught this from like there, like yeah, it's it was like right over there, like they just caught this. And you, you can you can tell like the taste. It's, it's, it's what, like I don't I don't like fish, but this shit is insane. Like. It, it's unparalleled like in flavor to the, the quality of like some shit that you could just get at home. El camarón empanado. Camarón empanado. Remind me of home. I can't even talk. Tell us what you think about it. Tell us what you think about it. We're living his life through food right now. I mean, come on. Dude. It doesn't get much better than that. I think what Christian just said is totally accurate. Right now, Danny's about to take us to Luquillo, a small beach town about 45 minutes away from San Juan. We're just gonna go to the beach, have a few drinks, and see where the day takes us. It's incredible how like we managed this trip and like we all made it out like we planned two weeks, and like this is where we ended up. Oh, 
that's excellent. Really? You get yeah, no, you get the flaky outside, the meat pocket is juicy, the, the chicken is still nice and juicy. It's no, let me cut a bite of that. I can't get enough of this right it's, now. Uh, it's really good. You can taste the mango, the pineapple. It's somehow it's blue. I don't know. <laughs> Before taking us back to San Juan, I asked Danny what he thought about his experience with us today. This is what he had to say. Yeah, yeah I have a good time with with you and all your group. You know, oh, that was amazing. You know, he's and out, you know, I I enjoy. I, I think I'm going um, the vacation with you. Yeah. You know, I spend the vacation with you. You know. Thank you. We're so headed over to our place in Old San Juan. We're gonna shower, get ready. But I really want to try this barbecue place the locals keep telling us about. It's Bebel's. So we're supposed to go out to eat lechon. It's one of uh, Puerto Rico's typical dishes. Um, we got sidetracked by this beautiful dog. Lechon. lechon. Yeah. It's just, I don't know, it's surreal to be here, you know? And to, to have visited all the, the beautiful places that we already saw, like, to see those beaches and like the colors and how beautiful it is there, but then coming back here where it's like, this is like the real, I guess like the real San Juan, if you want to talk about it like that, like like Danny was calling it, because it's, you look at those slums and it's like the most dangerous slum in, in Puerto Rico and it's like everybody's like, do not go there, but when, when I'm standing here and like looking out and like looking out at the ocean here, it's, this is the most beautiful part that I've seen so far. I mean, that's where every time I, I look at it, I'm just, I'm shocked. I don't, I, I don't really have words for it. I, I don't know what to say about it. You know? Okay, we're here at Bebo's Barbecue in San Juan, Puerto Rico, and I think this really captures the essence of what Puerto Rico is. We have a really low... Oh, yeah. It looks really good. There's mounds of just meat over there. Uh, there's yuca. And, uh, yeah, I mean, I don't, I don't know what to expect. I'm expecting there to be a lot of food. My hands are gonna be greasy and I'm just gonna be happy. This is the last, like, last real meal I'm having here. Had a ball out. You say play? Lechon, play. looking perfect. Tastes the part in your mouth. Nice, smoky flavor. Arroz con andules, you can't ever go wrong with that. Ever. The plantains have a special place in my life. Honestly, if I'm being honest, it, it really is one of my favorite food. No, but really, I mean, this shit is fucking amazing. It's the perfect, like, it's cream, like, not creamy, but it's like soft as fuck. No, like, it's delicious. It's so fucking sweet. That's the thing that like I hate when people are like, oh, it's the same thing as a banana, because this no, shit is fucking sweeter, it's yeah. so different. I, dude, this is a pinch. I've been searching for this the entire trip. I need a meaty ass bite. Mm, are you both? Dude. Puerto Rico trip's complete now. Is there any way your parents are gonna be able to see this? Because like this is definitely going on. Well, show. honestly, if they see it, I don't. At this yeah, point, seen you eating it pork looks. Before? It's not pork. Oh yeah, no, it's a steak. Bro. Don't worry, I'm Puerto Rican. Don't worry about that. <laughs> I got my good friends in here. <laughs> 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 Babos was amazing. It was delicious and it was some of the best food I had on the island. And I think it was a really good way to end this trip. We got to Puerto Rico less than a year after Hurricane Maria hit. And although you could see it physically, you could never feel it. The people there are stronger than they've ever been. They're prouder than they've ever been. And the culture is as vibrant as it could ever be. This really was an amazing experience. Thank you.